Hello everyone, so today we're doing a set review on the LEGO Star Wars 75391, the Captain Rex's Microfighter, Y-Wing Microfighter. Now the set does come with Captain Rex, obviously, from the Venator, so it's not really exclusive at this point anymore. It does come with 900, uh, sorry, 99 pieces, and so far the set is not looking that bad. This is what we ever wanted, but in more of a big scale, but hey, a Y-Wing will take it. Because, you know, for the Captain Rex minifigure, of course. As you can see, there's really nothing but a spring-loaded uh, spring you know, stud shooter at this point. So, nothing much going on. But, let's go ahead and open this up and see what there is inside. Alright, time to open up this small Lego set. Just gotta make sure I'm covering it carefully. Okay, so I'm looking for about, like, two bags. Of course, not numbered. Normally, in these small sets, they don't ever number them. But, oh. Since when do they number small set bags? Since when? Since when? The, 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 Manda, the ambush on Mandalore doesn't have numbered bags. What is this one? Oh, come on, man. Anyways, but here's going to be the render. Yeah, kind of sucks. Uh, let's see, any advertising. Yep, so more of the June sets. And, of course, you know, you get the building on and whatever. This is going to be his, um, I forgot what they're called. It's not a cape, it's like a pauldron or whatever. One of those. And then, of course, the accessories for his helmet. But let's go ahead and build this up and let's review Captain Rex. Alright, everyone. So, as you can see, we have a new setup here. As you can see, we have Captain Rex, who we're going to review right now. But my setup is currently unavailable. We are doing remodeling with our house so right now my normal setup is going to be currently gone for now it will be back up soon but right now i'm going to be filming here for my set reviews until i know i notify you guys that my setup is back so first of all we're gonna have captain rex in this set he does come with his own um headpiece you yeah, have the where the in, in where the inhibitor chip was if i'm not mistaken that's what it's called and of course the captain rex helmet fantastic we got the the numbers on his helmet nothing in the back but you know we have just the the fine details of the captain rex helmet it has come with this pauldron as well which i appreciate finally something that's not printed it has wheeled his double pistols and then we have some arm printing of course leg printing no waist cape which kind of sucks but anyways that's just lego but overall this captain rex minifigure is amazing all right everyone and here is the y-wing itself we have been asking for one for so long and we get a micro fighter hey it's what we get can't complain really what we wanted was the wiring and then with the captain rex as well so we got what we got in a smaller version so we do have the blasters in the front we got some stud shooters there the small windshield the cockpit uh some blue and white striping as well since it's a 501st y-wing we have the engines over here with the thrust the pink ones i like these these are very great additions when it comes to a um micro fighter it adds just that other fine detail to the set and then of course this is where a droid would normally go but of course there's no room in this micro fighter in the back really nothing on the bottom plane as well but i'm really liking this micro fighter i like how they got the the blue and white just covered overall because i know that sometimes lego likes to go cheap with their colors but overall here it's fantastic and the y-wing is i mean they they just got it spot on Alright everyone, this is going to conclude our set review for $15. I'd say go, just buy this. The Captain Rex minifigure is fantastic. I know the set came out around May 4th era. No, June 1st, sorry. I'm mistaken. June 1st. This thing came out June 1st and a lot of people got it. So a lot of people already have Captain Rex. But if you want more, go ahead and buy this set. $15, that's a snag for a popular clone trooper. And overall, the set is fantastic. I'm giving the set a 10 out of 10. I don't see what's wrong with the set. Stud shooters are fine. I mean, spring loaded are always, you know, favorable. But a fantastic set. And I'll see you guys in the next set review.